What is up ladies and gentlemen, we're back here for yet another awesome fishing video and uh, we're out here, we're doing some pond fishing and uh, I'm actually at this golf course that you guys have seen me fish uh, a couple times, not a lot, but a couple times um, and my grandma actually used to live here um, or on the golf course, but they open at 7 o'clock and that's about 40 minutes from right now, so I don't know if they'll come around to like if they come around to check all the holes or whatever, but I'm hoping that I'm, I'm I can just fish as long as I as I can until I either get kicked out or there's like starts to be lots of golfers. Um, but it is like the middle. It would be like the very beginning of a weekday, so I'm not sure that there's if there's many people out there on a weekday early morning trying to play some golf. I don't know. Maybe you guys do that. I'm not sure. I'm, I don't really play golf, obviously, but. I'm hoping that I don't get get kicked out before that seven o'clock time period because that's when they open. Um, when they open, I mean, I'm sure I'll see a couple golfers. So, um, other than that, I've got a buzz bait and a chatterbait tied on right there. I'm hoping that I can get something on the buzz bait. I tried to get out here as soon as I could. I woke up at like 5:45 or something like that, pretty early, and uh, I'm just going to kind of run this bank right down here. Uh, all the way around and it looks pretty top water -y ish uh, Looks pretty top water -y. Yeah, that kind of thing um, so on that Yeah, oh, I already see something over there So I'm gonna put the camera down turn on the GoPro and uh, we're gonna see if we can catch some fish Oh, we, oh no, I had one I had one eat it. He just kind of like sucked it under, but I had him. He just, yeah, he just kind of sucked it under. That was a super weird bite. That's why I didn't really set the hook, then I just saw my line kind of moving around. Dang it, that sucks. That stinks, but first, first bite already on the Warriga buzz bait. Just a little black one plopping around. Yeah. Oh my, we had one, had another one blow up on it, missed him though, dang it, I knew I was going to have a bite there at least, man, oh we got him, we got a fish, we got a fish on the buzz bait, we got one, we got one, oh, I think it's a decent one, I think it's a decent one guys, oh yeah, buzz bait fish. There we go, look at that, flipping a decent fish right there. I don't know if this is the same fish that blew up on the buzz bait first, but we definitely got him. And it looks like my, oh no, my trailer hook got him. Look at that, check out that fish on the buzz bait. Super healthy fish right there, guys. Awesome fish, look at that. Alrighty guys, I'm going to toss him back. There's now a little bit of a ledge here. Oh. There we go. Nice fish. That that guy will get your heart pumping. Blew up on the buzzbait. That is awesome. I uh, I haven't caught a buzzbait fish all year. Um, and I actually don't throw the buzzbait too much, but I've seen some guys on Instagram, and um, I know you guys want to see some topwater fish. So this is a little bit different than a frog, obviously, because you're moving it always. Um, and frogs, you know, you're popping it on, on top and everything, walking it, whatever. But uh, this is, it's a little bit different and I kind of want to just show you guys something different than like, you know, your standard topwater frog fishing, that kind of deal. So, awesome fish, just hit it like super, super close to the bank. But uh, other than that, I'm gonna see if I can catch another one. Oh my gosh, we had one. What I tell you guys, we had one. Oh, that was perfect too. You know, you guys know what? In order sometimes to catch some of these fish, you can kind of go around them and approach them for a different angle. So if you miss a fish, they, they're probably gonna be looking for, they probably know where you are a little bit more. And so if you approach them from you know a different angle like I'm gonna switch 
sides of the bank that I was casting from, then you know you might be able to might be able to land that fish. Oh no, we had one. Had one just kind of like suck it under. Again, I don't know why we're losing these fish. I wasn't really paying attention, but I've, I've even got a trailer hook on here. Oh, we have a fish, guys. Oh, no, he came off. He came off. I didn't get a very good hook set in him. He just kind of... He kind of felt like grass or something. It wasn't a big one, though. But, man. I had a fish. Yeah, I didn't even know I... didn't even know he bit. It was just heavy all of a sudden. Alrighty, guys. Well, that's unfortunately going to do it for me today. I am getting hot, especially my back is getting hot because... I am, my back is to the sun, and oh man, it is, it is getting hot, but did not actually catch a fish on the, uh, on the chatterbait, uh, the, that one fish came off, I'm not really sure why, uh, but my main theory is, um, it, it was, the bite was like mush, you know, it, it just got heavy, and I thought, I didn't know if there was grass or something, so I just kind of like leaned back a little bit into it. Um, and, and then I noticed it was a fish and by the time that he came up and jumped, jumped off, it was, you know, too late to set the hook. But I did catch a fish on the, uh, on the buzz bait, which is pretty sweet. So, uh, other than that, I will catch you guys back at the outro. Alrighty guys. Well, I'm going to end the video down here at the pond and, uh, I'm, I'm going to wrap it up, wrap up today's little morning, early morning fishing session um one before the golfers get here i haven't it's actually like eight o'clock now i've been fishing for a couple hours and i haven't even seen one golfer there was one guy who came by picking up trash and that was it um so uh yeah but it was it was a decent time out here i'm gonna head back one because i'm getting hot and two i haven't had breakfast yet and i am starving mega starving um so i don't know what i'm gonna do about that but probably run through somewhere and get some breakfast but um i did catch one fish on the buzz bait which was pretty sweet I hadn't caught a fish on a buzz bait all year so that was pretty sweet um and then i i actually had a lot of buzz bait blow ups um i had lots of fish trying to eat the buzz bait um i i believe i had one fish i, I yeah it was kind of a while ago uh, but I did I hooked a couple on the buzz bait, but they ended up coming off or not getting it good enough You know um, and then I caught that I almost caught that one on the chatter bait Which came off as well the like I was saying in the video from the GoPro the bite was just it just got heavy all of a sudden And so I just tried to like I didn't know if it was grass or something because there's not really not much grass in this pond um, except for like on the bank and so I wasn't really sure what it was, so I just kind of like leaned into it a little bit, and at that point, he jumped and he spit the hook. So, um, other than that, it was a pretty good time, um, and uh, I will definitely be coming out, come back out to this pond. And uh, I also want to tell you guys that I just got a new rat. Um, I went to a fishing store the other day, actually, it was yesterday, and I bought a rat. Um, it was kind of on sale, a couple dollars off, but. Um, I bought a rat, so stay tuned for a fishing video on that, and uh, it should be a pretty good one. So, on that, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys.